Somerset Yoronga, they've created some really stunning individual townhouses. And even though they're pleasing to the eye, I like knowing there's been a conscious use of sustainable and quality materials. I remember walking towards the house for the first time. There's a real sense of place. The doors open to a fabulous light-filled room with high ceilings and timber floors. There's a great flexibility of space thanks to things like the kitchen island bench and the large terrace. And downstairs, the courtyard also makes the most of Queensland's unique indoor-outdoor living environment. I think a lot of thought has gone into this design. There's double garaging and private street front entry, giving each owner their own sense of individual identity. And in terms of location, it's really hard to beat. Here we're surrounded by parks and the river. It's a real laid back yet sophisticated village lifestyle. Just across that green bridge, you'll find the University of Queensland. There, there are bike paths, running tracks, an Olympic sized swimming pool, as well as a tennis centre and golf course. Naturally, there are also a number of great restaurants and cafes in Nyoronga. Otherwise, it's only seven kilometres to the city, with the train station just around the corner and a bikeway taking you almost anywhere. In fact, our favourite thing to do on a Sunday morning is take a leisurely ride around the park, stop for a coffee, maybe a picnic somewhere by the river, and then head over to the Art House Chanel Cinema at the University of Queensland for a movie. But there's nothing quite like coming home again. And with a lifestyle like this, and knowing the builder and developer's long history of local success, I don't think these townhouses will be around for long. With ongoing high rental demand in Yoronga, new stages of the Somerset Complex are commencing soon.